Hi everyone, my name is Nate Klepfer and I'm a student here at BYU and today I'll be talking about wealth redistribution policies, namely progressive taxation and welfare programs. And the first, the big problem with wealth redistribution programs is that they tend to make economies stagnate or collapse. Um, and I'm going I'm to be going over some of these reasons. The first part is progressive taxation. Um, an example of this is in Sweden, where they had, they've had a high corporate tax rate for many years. And as a result of this, this has, made, this has prompted entrepreneurs and businessmen to move their companies elsewhere. So a lot of the innovation has left Sweden and gone to places like the United States of America with lower tax rates. Another side of wealth redistribution is welfare programs, especially the ones that are very generous. These tend to have very high tolls on government spending. Um, these, these also are seen in Greece. Um, and Greece has had a recent economic crisis with their debt. They, about 10 years ago, they suffered from the Great Recession just like a lot of the other parts of the world did. But they also came into it with a very high level of debt. And that debt was caused, was a lot of that came from those welfare policies that the Greeks had. And so the debt was so high that when the economy contracted that they couldn't go on with it anymore. So they had to, they had to cut spending somewhere. And so they cut spending on the welfare programs in one, as one way to do that. And these were the austerity measures that we heard about several years ago. And unfortunately, the Greek economy became so dependent on government spending that when that happened, it caused the economy to contract for five years straight. And my, my desire, my wish is to avoid, avoid that happening here in the United States of America. We need to keep on having um, free economic policies, laissez-faire economics here, in order to avoid being in a spending trap. It's better to, to, not, to not be in these programs and to institute them and, to, and then to withdraw from them and have the economy collapse. And in the words of John F. Kennedy in his Secret Society speech, we look for strength and assistance, confident that with your help, man will be what he was born to be, free and independent. Thank you.